Industrial 3D printer manufacturer Titan Robotics has announced the launch of their new Atlas HS hybrid additive manufacturing system. Unveiled at AMUG last month, the system comes complete with a tool changer that works with both a pellet extrusion head and a three-axis milling tool head, enabling 3D printed parts to be machined during and after the printing process. Now, this thing is a massive printer. Like, we're talking you could probably squeeze at least 20 people if you really had to into this printer. With build volumes up to 1270 by 1270 by 1828 millimeters, and they'll even make you a custom size if you want. They're known for their signature pellet extrusion 3D printers, and Titan Robotics already has an extensive portfolio of their Atlas 3D printers. Using pellet extrusion instead of filament, they say can speed up production by up to 10 times, with print speeds as fast as 500 millimeters a second, or as they say in the CNC world, 30,000 millimeters per minute. Now the latest entry into the Atlas series is built for both functional prototyping and end-use production, with primary applications being, of course, molds, tools, jigs, and fixtures. Now they've aimed it at manufacturers and everything from aerospace to consumer goods. And the Atlas HS is an extremely versatile machine. The new printer even has a heated build chamber and has long been capable of printing high temperature materials like CF Peak, CF Ultim, glass filled PEC, uh, nylons, and many, many more. Now Clay Guillory, the founder and CSO of Titan Robotics, that is chief services officer of Titan Robotics, explains, we have designed the Atlas HS in keeping with our core values of offering production-ready systems and customizable features. As with all of our Atlas models, the Atlas HS will be available with industrial and advanced features that customers can select to meet their needs and their end-use applications, such as a tool changer with multiple tools available. Now, like the rest of the Titan Robotics systems, the Atlas HS operates on a three-axis CNC motion control system and a welded steel frame. Users can also incorporate custom features like I.O. sensors, air filtration, material dryers, as and when needed. Now, some things you don't find on other 3D printers include a chip collection system and spindle sizes up to a quarter inch in diameter and four inches in tool length. Now these guys are doing great things out there in Colorado, so be sure to follow them on social media. I believe it's Titan 3D Robotics. And like this video to help it get more views and subscribe if you want more news like this. Anyway, thanks for watching. Have a positive rest of your day and I'll see you on the next video.